welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. I have my February stitch fix. I didn't think it was going to come. I thought I'd put it in for a second one for February 18th and I actually put it in for February or March 18th and then there were like no slots available. So this one actually came early. Stitch fix seems to be doing something new where they are letting you get eight items. I don't know whether this is everybody. I don't know whether they're trying it out only with certain people, certain markets, but I was able to select eight things. It did say for a limited time. I only, my only wish with that was that they would give me more in my preview. I probably had 10 in my preview. I thought I only counted nine. If you hear things, it's the cats um, playing. Um, so I'm excited about that. I wonder if they're kind of trying to compete with Wantable and give you eight items. I will say there weren't eight I loved, but I picked eight anyway, just on the off chance I did. Um, also, I was kind of expecting to know by now whether they were going to cancel my pass, my style pass or not. February is my original anniversary. And so I went in to check and my now it says good through April. So, and it actually words it as, you know, we'll renew April something, something. So I don't know whether they extended it. I don't know what that means anyway. And my last disclaimer is I'm always going to be honest. So I'm going to tell it how it is. And if that's not your jam, that is totally okay. Um, you guys don't have to watch. So I'm very, very lucky in that I don't get negative people very often, but I will be honest when I get negative people, I just block you guys. I don't, I don't need the negative energy in my life. I don't, um, but I'm not going to just sit here and be like, I love everything. Uh, even if I don't. So anyway, let's see what we have. I do have eight items. No way. I don't think I'll be keeping them. I have Caleb as a stylist, totally new. Um, I asked for a purse. I asked for pants that aren't jeans. I asked for jewel tone tops. Mm. And I asked for a casual dress that could still be dressed up. And I did get two choices of a purse. No pants. I really, I don't need jeans. I'm in the market for, I don't know, cargo pants, work pants, any, anything else but jeans. But they did get that. Let's start with the purse first. One of the purses was like a big kind of satchel, which I just knew wouldn't be my thing. Honestly, this is already bigger than I thought. I was pretty sure this would be a no-go just because it looked very small in the picture. So this is uh, more promising than I thought. I really like this. And it has two zippers. So zippers are number one important. I want to put my phone and key somewhere. So this has two of them. Um, this feels like a faux suede, so I'm a, you know, I would worry about staining, but this is really cute and way bigger than I would thought, think. Oh gosh, this snaps apart and then there are card holders in there. That's kind of, I like that. Now, snapping apart doesn't do much for me because it's not like you could just fill that up and then leave it like that, but that's kind of a cute feature. And then it does have that striped stuff. So a uh, phone keys would totally fit in that. The snapping thing is really uh, unique. This also feels very good quality. It feels very soft. It does not feel like, like a very kind I don't know, like, um, it's not obvious plastic, I guess. Um, and then there's a zipper pocket in here. I will say I kind of wish the inside was just a little bigger, um, but I do like it. I honestly, I feel like this could be a keeper if the straps are long enough. Um, this just is, I don't know. I really like this a lot. So in my try on, I will take the straps down because um, as a plus size gal, often their purses do not have a long strap and I, it ends up hitting me in the stomach. I really like this. It feels really nice quality. Let's see. This is the Market and Spruce Lexi crossbody. Um, I'm kind of impressed. It, I wish it was slightly more roomy, but otherwise I love it. Um, and it is $44. So I'm liking that. That's, we're up to a good start. 
And I had picked that one thinking there's no way it would be remotely big enough. Alrighty. So, I will say, I feel like the most popular color jewel tone is green. Green is a really good color on me, but my bundle has lots of green. All right, first one up is 41 and Hawthorne. I love the color. I don't mind, I love three, four sleeve. I'm not a fan of the tab sleeve. I love the blue in here. I will say this is not my favorite polyester. This is that crepey, thick polyester. Generally, when I put this style of polyester on, it kind of feels hot and thick. Um, I don't mind the front the way it is. So overall, I like it. It would be good for work. I don't, I just, one of my complaints here lately with Stitch Fix is I personally think as a cost cutting measure, they're using cheaper, not as nice fabrics. Let's see how much this is. $48. So the Moray split neck three force blouse, $48. Also, if I kept all eight items, it would be $286, which I think is a fabulous deal. But I just don't think that would be happening. So I do like it. We will see. We will see how it is. Up next is a black top. I really need a black top. I hope, I hope it fits. Um, it does have crisscross in the back, which I can say I'm not, I can take it or leave it. I want this to go under a cardigan. And of course I would wear it in other ways too, but it is a V-neck black top. I need it. I need more staples. I need like a white t-shirt, a black t-shirt. So I am hoping this works. Market and Spruce, Taily crisscross back, $35. Please, please fit. I could use this. Um, it's very soft fabric. So I like this. I'm hoping it fits. $35, totally good. All right, this is by Lathering. And I've had a top from them before and I really like it. So this is green. I will say it is a very see-through polyester. I like these little sleeves. I'm not sure what style. Oh, I will say there is a bunch of fraying. I'm not sure that's coming across. Um, whatever this little kind of crinkle fabric is, I really like it. Um, so this is a 2X. I like this. Will it fit? It is a polyester, so there is no stretch, and I'm kind of sensing it's not going to fit, but we will see. Um, this is the Tate V-neck blouse, $40. Once again, a good price, um, and I like this. I do have a lot of green. I will say I am getting a wardrobe of lots of green. All right, up next, this is a, um, I think, Market, no, Mason and Bell. Um, I will say the pattern is a little out there, but I do love the color. I love the three, four sleeves. I am hoping these aren't too tight. I will say I kept a green shirt that had these. I feel the tightness every single day. So if these are even remotely tight, I will not make that mistake. Um, I don't mind the top because it has kind of this like see-through, um, lacy stuff. Um, I'm interested to see how this looks on. I will just say I do feel like the pattern is very loud. Oh, I like the bottom. The bottom even has like a little kind of rick-rack lacy thing. Um, but I do love burgundy. So we will see how this fits. This next one, I kind of just wanted to see how it fit in case there were other colors available. Uh, this is Daniel Rain. This color is just generally not a good color on me, but I did love the V-neck. Three, four sleeve. I will say for a Daniel Rain, this is probably gonna be $68. This also just feels like cheap, crepey polyester. It also has these and they feel very tight. So I, but again, I kept this just for fun because they were giving me eight pieces. This color is generally a color that just washes me out. And this is the Daniel Rain Perry Lace Detail, $68. I'm telling you, this quality on this Daniel Rain 
does not feel $68 worth. This feels just as cheap as polyester as the other tops for $40. So that's a little disappointing. I really in the past have felt like their fabrics have been better. I love the style of this though, if they had it in a different color. All right, another green top. This is by Monday Fun in a 2X. And again, this was another one I kept thinking there's no way because it has so much white in it. Um, this is the Kearney Henley blouse, $45. Uh, oh, I like the sleeve. It's not elastic. All the other sleeves are elastic. So I like that sleeve. This fabric feels either a better polyester or a blend. Let's see. Oh, it's rayon. I honestly, I hate rayon. I will say thank you to all of you guys that basically say after the wash, pull, pull, pull in all directions. And that does work, but I feel like it's still shrinks a, a tad or at least like as you continue to wash it it kind of shrinks a tad but that stretching does solve a lot of that so we will see again i just kept it for fun because i got to keep eight, eight pieces and have them send them and then i think we're on the fourth or third green item um i like this fabric this fabric feels nice this is a dress green polka dot I'm hoping this works. We had open house the other night and I was kind of in the mood to wear a dress and I didn't really have, I only had a summer dress. So uh, I don't wear dresses often, but when the mood strikes, I would like to have one or two options. This is the 41 Hawthorne Elise Knit Sur 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 I'm sure I, this should be obvious to me, Sur Plice. Phonetically, that's how it's, that's surplice. That can't be how you say it. Anyway, $54. Let's see here. So this is a full on, like, no snap situation, which unless that fits really securely, I am not comfortable with at school. I also do not like wearing tanks under dresses. Um, so I feel like I would have to get that sewn in. Um, it's also seeming a little short to me. So this has potential. I'm a little worried about the white parts and definitely this open thing here. Um, also, I've kind of stopped requesting dresses because I feel like for a long time, Stitch Fix had the really nice uh, snatch at the waist and then full A-line. And I feel like here lately, they have not been as flowy. I kind of like um, them to flow from my stomach down so then you're not seeing all of that. I just have this feeling it's too short. We will see. All right, let's get to the fun part, which is the try on. All right, I am surprised out of the gate. I like this one. Um, I don't like the white as much as I like, you know, it's not my preference, but I love the V-neck. I like the buttons. I love the sleeves. I will say the sleeves are a little odd in that they're not quite full length. And they're not three-fourths either. I'm really tall, so I feel like if you are short, these might be full length. But I like this more than I thought I would. Um, I think it flows really nice. This is rayon. Um, so I don't love that, but thanks to you guys, I have learned to stretch it out and make it work. So I like this more than I thought I would. Um, I would love to know your thoughts keep or not keep. Um, I could easily see wearing this next week. Is it a love, love, love over the moon? No, but definitely think I could get some use out of this. Let's see. Oh, I don't know. Where are the tags? I'm not quite sure. Let's see. It's a green one. I don't know. Not sure how much this is. Um, not quite sure. I think it's in the $40 range, but I am, I'm liking it. So let's go on. Oh, I have my purse. So I'm hoping this fits. I'm kind of thinking not. I have it on the very last notch. I just, the quality on this, this part is just so soft. I love the little attention to detail. Um, I, I don't know. Let's, let's see. 
So it's, I, you know, it's not the worst fit, but this is not how I would like it. Um, so it does kind of just come in the middle of my stomach. And, uh, so I think sadly it's a no go. I would say one more inch down and it would be perfect. It's not the worst. It's not the worst, but it's a slightly awkward, especially if it comes in the front, which of course I don't normally wear it in the front. So it's not terrible, but it's about an inch off. Also, I'm a little concerned on space on the inside. So I might try it, get all my stuff, see if that works or not. Um, I wish instead of having this pull out, I wish they had made extra space in the bag. I just don't see me leaving cards right there but this is a very nice quality um if you're wanting to try a bag and this is your style the market and spruce lexi crossbody I feel like this is very good quality so this is a contender but I kind of feel like both of these have a couple of issues that kind of take them out of the running all right let's go on to the next piece all right, up next we have the Mason and Bell. I like it as more than I thought I would. I will say it's 100% rayon. I will also say I'm fairly sure these things are tighter than I would like. Just wearing it right now, it is okay, but I can feel it. And I feel like if I can feel it now, I'm going to feel it later. I do like this top. Again, I could see myself wearing it next week to work. Um, I like the three, four sleeves. I like the cut. It's flowy. Uh, I like the overall color. I like it, but it's rayon, which like I said, is not a death sentence, but I don't know. I would love to know from anybody out there. Is there anything a seamstress can do for this? Um, I wish this had the sleeve like the other top where, um, I don't know. Can, could it, I mean, I don't think I like this top enough to go down that road, have them cut it off and like hem it, but like, this is just too tight. Um, so sadly I just, I feel like it's stitch fix new thing to have these, um, elastic wristbands. So this top would be 48 if I kept it. Um, and I like it but I don't think I'm going to keep it. Wait, there's a teddy. Uh, Spirit's actually over here. Let's see. Can we see Spirit? Say hi, Spirit. So this is our more social cat. The other cat ran under, under the bed. So I don't know. I feel like these sleeves are the no way Jose, because I don't think it's worth for me to pay like 10 bucks to get them, you know, cut apart. So sadly, I think this top is a no um because of the elastic sleeves all right this is the one i kept that i knew would not work this is not a color that looks good on me this is daniel rain it's also rayon it is also too tight like it just does not flow um this is i think full length sleeve they are elastic these are not too tight but this is just an automatic no which i kind of knew um i was kind of testing to see if i like the style but it's just not flowy. I feel like Daniel Ray here lately, they used to like have such good cuts where they were super flowy, where they needed to be flowy, kind of give you a shape where they needed to give you shape. Um, again, this color is just not good on me and it's too tight. So it's an automatic no. All right, I am back with the black top. I will say it's the cheapest top at $35. It also seems to have the best fabric out of any of them. I love the V-neck. I like black on me. Um, I'm This may be the keeper because I really need a layering piece to wear under a couple of cardigans. If it wasn't for the layering piece, it may be a no-go just because it's kind of long um, and it's not cut. I don't feel like it's cut well. It's just kind of long. It doesn't give me any shape. It's not terrible. Um, I don't know how I feel about the cutout. I can't see it. And probably with my hair down, most people couldn't anyway. Um, so, but I do think I could front tuck this with a cardigan. 
Um, and I think with a cardigan is totally fine. So this is probably going to be a keeper. I've had a cardigan I couldn't wear all winter just because I didn't have a black top and I couldn't really find one. I didn't, I wouldn't say I searched too hard, but, um, so this may be the keeper just because I need it as a layering piece and it would be a very practical thing in my wardrobe. Um, so we will see. I do like the fabric. This is my favorite fabric so far. Um, but the cut, I just, I don't know. Um, things, is it too hard to ask for nice flowy cuts? I don't know. All right. I really love this one, but there's an asterisk, which I believe it makes it a no go. So this is the, I believe the La Seren. And it's the Tate V-neck in green, $40. It's a great price. I really love, really love these ruffle sleeves with kind of like the crinkle. Um, I love the V-neck. I love the color. I, on camera, you guys are going to tell me it fits and looks great. And standing up, it absolutely fits. So while I'm standing, it fits. I will say you can kind of see my bra through it, which I'm not a fan of, or like, I mean, like the, the texture or the line of it, but I can tell already just from standing here, the minute I sit, it is going to be tight. So this barely fits standing up. And again, I'm sure on camera, it looks fine, but it is, it needs to be about a half inch bigger in all the realms. And I'm fairly sure a three X would be too big. Um, especially cause it kind of fits appropriately. But again, I, I can almost guarantee you when I sit down, it's just going to be so tight around my stomach. So sadly, this is going to have to go back. I really, really do like it. I think with a nice kind of pretty chunky necklace, this would look really good. I like it a lot. All right, we are back. I feel like every piece of clothes has like the, I love this, but. So I believe this is the 41 Hawthorne Moray Split 3-4 Sleeve, $48. It's by far, I think, my favorite color and favorite pattern out of these tops. I love the color. I, I love the neckline. Um, I have two sort of butts. So I like this quite a bit. I think it's a good cut. Definitely an easy piece to wear to work. My only butts, and I think they may be uh, forgivable. One is I don't like the tab sleeve. I just, it's not a deal breaker, but it's just not my fun thing. I don't like when it like lays down like this. Let's take one of the buttons off and see. So if I do that, I kind of like it better, although I can feel that thing hanging down. Maybe I could cut that off. So this kind of makes the sleeve more like the other top. So that actually might be better because I just, I don't, for whatever reason, I'm not a fan when it like hangs down. Um, the fabric, I do not like the crepey polyester. It's just rough. I won't go so far as to say itchy, but it's minutely uncomfortable. So it's like every single, like there, every piece has a thing. Like I need to watch the video back on this piece. I like the fabric. This is a soft. I like the sleeve. I like this. I wish it was in this pattern. This is just scratchy and I don't love this, but I do, do love the color on me on, I just, I don't know. This one is closer to being a keeper than the other ones. I need to watch the video back, but I'm never a fan of all the white. Um, I feel like everything is kind of, again, asterisk. Um, we have one more piece, which is the dress. So let's see how that goes. All right, I am back with the dress. Um, and I think it needs to be bigger, which I think would cause problems. So I like the color. I love the fabric. It's a very comfortable fabric. This is secure. I don't think this is going anywhere. So I don't even feel the need to put a little snap but it is very tight on my back, very clingy on my back. Um, I also think it's a smidge too short. And I know you guys are always like, just exchange it for the 3X, you can always return it. 
and that is very true. I could exchange it for the 3X, but then I have the price of this sitting on my credit card for, I would wager three weeks at least. Um, I kept my jeans on, um, which I know is not the most ideal. From the front, I don't think it looks overly bad. Um, it is a little clingy, or I should say a, a lot clingy. It is very clingy in the back. Um, it does pass the finger test, but not by much. And I wear kind of like a spanky undergarment that kind of comes like down to my thigh. And I'm fairly sure, especially in the back, you would maybe be able to see that. So I just don't know how it would fit as a 3X. Sometimes 3Xs are minutely bigger. Sometimes they're a bunch bigger. So up here, I would be really afraid that this would start getting loosey-goosey. Um, and I'm not sure, you know, would it help in the back? So this has potential, but I just... I'm just not one to send it back and ask for another size. Um, I could do that. I don't know. It also has a lot of white, which I don't know if it matters, but I kind of always feel like the white kind of takes away from the green. I do like it, but it clearly does not fit appropriately. Let's do a recap. Um, I would definitely, this is in real time, so I'm filming it today. It will go up tonight at midnight, so definitely could use your help. Um, I mean, if we're going to be honest, I feel like the true answer is I send it all back because every little thing has a but. Um, so let's do a recap. I really like this top, but it doesn't fit. Um, it's just a tad too, I mean, it's when I sit down, it is stomach like a sausage casing. So I could, you know, trade both of these in for a 3X and see how it goes. But this is definitely, I love it, but when I sit down, it is uncomfortable and too tight. I definitely could use this. It is not an I love by any means, but I definitely, if it gets cold again, would use this to wear under a cardigan. So I'm kind of like, do I need it enough just for that? Because it really, for me, is too long and shapeless at the bottom. Um, but I do love the fabric. I do love the black v-neck. But because I'm not a super fan of how it hugs my hips, I would probably only wear it with a couple cardigans. This was just an absolute no. Not my color and too tight. I really liked this one. But... These little elastics are way too tight, so it's just not happening because of that. Um, this was my first piece, and because I had to go get my daughter in between, it's been like an hour since I've tried this on. Um, I really did like it. I liked the cut, um, et cetera, et cetera. It was just, my thing is, I don't like the white, which I know I've said a thousand times. So that's my only negative is the pattern, I guess, the white in the pattern. Um, I need to watch the video back. So this was probably my closest, kind of. But then we had this piece, which I wish I could swap. <laughs> I just love the colors of this. I mean, love the colors of this. Um, I just hate the I mean you can kind of you can see it like just the crepey it's just rough like it's not like so rough it's a deal breaker but it's not my preferred fabric so I love the pattern of this every piece has an asterisk what do you guys think is there anything worthwhile um I kind of like this but I don't know if it's so much that I love 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 it like if it's fit I can't say I would be dying to wear it on Monday. So I don't feel like it's worth the trouble of sending it back for a 3X. What do I do guys? Do I send it all back? Do I keep a piece? I don't know. Help me out. I hope you have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.